every chemotherapy administration. From August 2022, Joyce's tumor burst open and oozed continuously until January 2023 when it dried up. That time we thought she was even getting better and that is when she was telling everybody nimepona najua nitakuwa shuleni. In December 2022, Joyce suffered congestive heart failure and developed difficulties in breathing. Joyce was advised to withdraw chemotherapy on 3rd February at Moy Referral Hospital, Eldoret. And she was switched to palliative care because her vital organs had failed to function. Um, palliative care means uh, the doctor just said she should be taken care of from, a, um, we call it a hospice, or just from home because there was nothing more that they could do. So that is what it means by palliative care. She got into a coma and lost coordination. I experienced that even her last days when I saw her. After uh, four units of blood platelets were transfused into her on 3rd February 2023. She was taken to Kanika Hospital Kisumu where she was admitted uh, the whole family from Chango and the whole family from her home, led by my, her sister Emily, were there. Even her two aunts were there. She passed on when we were watching. The doctor had diagnosed kidney failure. That is what he came to tell us. That he's trying to treat one thing and another one develops. He said, I'm trying to fight but the disease is fighting harder than uh, he's, try, he's trying. So the doctor diagnosed kidney failure, brain infection, breathing problems, and he later announced her death at 5 p.m. Now, apart from um, uh, the hospitals I have read, these are other hospitals we have witnessed Joyce being taken. The Higa Rifaro Hospital, Mongoma Hospital, Africa Inuka Hospital, Alexandria Cancer Center in Eldoret, Riale Hospital in Eldoret, Jaramogi Oginga Odinga Hospital in Kisumu, where our brother-in-law Wilson was helping her, us to get blood. And a letter damu, wanasema group O positive, ningumu kupata. Uh, we get uh, five donors, Wanampa mbili kwa sababu hizi zingine hazipatikani. Nightingale Hospital, Kanika Hospital International, Oasis Hospital, Avenue Hospital, Bliss Hospital, Moi Rifaro Hospital. Situ lijaribu. Eh, hoping that she would get better. But God said he was a flower. she was a flower to nip. Joyce had lived for 47 years and 11 and a half months on earth. In fact, her birthday was going to be on 20th of February, but she just passed on two weeks early. Sorted to say my amen. Nataka ni 